Well, not too unique shopping experience recently opening on Buffalo's east side. Our Krista Moran giving a voice tonight to Western New York's a Bangladesh com business community, bringing a 60,000 square foot bazaar to the Buffalo Trade Center. This is on Walden Ave. Buffalo Trade Center is bringing a unique approach to Buffalo's east side. Rather than uh, supplying the Buffalo with what we think will work, we're asking the community, uh, what would you like? And that's the difference uh, in this building. Adam Samad is the executive director of the center. He showed me around the 60,000 square foot building that has 34 stalls for businesses to open up shop. Um, so whether you have a barbershop, a stall, you need shelving, you can basically do whatever you like. So we got together with a group of friends and family members and we invested in a building like this um, to basically uh, get the community together under one roof where we could have multiple businesses that can provide services and products that are unique and different. Samad says plans are in the works to have a grand opening for the bazaar in the summer. Eventually, there will be a food court, indoor playground area, community center, and supermarket. This, uh, this location has been um, vacant you know, under one ownership for a long time as an industrial place, but uh, we want to bring it alive. Right now, there's a test run of the liquidation center and bazaar with vendors that will run through Ramadan. Once that ends, Samad's hope is to make this a bustling hub for this part of Buffalo, but now he's looking for businesses to make that a reality. Over here, we have displays from local artists. So this is one of the things that I would really uh, like to see uh, local artists, young uh, um, Students and entrepreneurs come in here and showcase their products and services. We want businesses and backgrounds from all over Buffalo to come in and explore and get their feet wet. This will, uh, I think, bring up this side of Buffalo, especially um, since it's been quieter over the years. Krista Moran, 7 News, Buffalo.